All right, you've come to get some information about comparing the two accounting softwares, FreshBooks and Xero. Before I dive into that, I want to mention that I've done other comparison videos between FreshBooks and QuickBooks Online and FreshBooks and Wave. So check those out after you watch this video. Uh, links to those are going to be in the description below. But you're here because you're considering Xero or FreshBooks for your bookkeeping uh, tasks for your business. I should disclose that I'm building a business on serving clients on FreshBooks, so I'm clearly a little biased. I even got the t-shirt. Um, and I can also get you FreshBooks free for 90 days if you do decide to go with FreshBooks. You can just use my accounting partner referral link uh, below in the description. But I do try to be unbiased in my videos. I don't want to push you into an accounting software that I like if it's not a good fit for you. So, so with those disclaimers out of the way, let's dive in. So I've got good news and bad news for you. Uh, the bad news is that, is that I've never served any small business clients on zero, so I'm not going to pretend to offer a robust review of something that I'm not familiar with. So this is not going to be a really in-depth comparison like my other comparison videos comparing FreshBooks to Wave and FreshBooks to QuickBooks Online. Those videos are very in-depth comparisons, um, so, so check them out. But this is not going to be th like that. Um, but the good news is, is that I'm still going to help give you some advice about how you can compare the two softwares and some things about Xero that stand out to me. So when you are looking for a bookkeeping software, you want to compare the software on the following metrics. Price, reports, integrations, support, time tracking, payroll, payments and invoicing, and also accountant support. So write down those categories and then go to both the FreshBooks website and the Xero websites and see how they stack up against each other. Think about the features that your particular business will need. And then you should be able to make a clear-headed comparison. Speaking in very general terms, Xero's higher level plans are going to be able to serve more robust and complicated businesses than FreshBooks. Uh, but there are also many businesses for whom the feature set of Xero would be much more than they are ever going to need. Another thing I can tell you about Xero is that I have worked closely with their North American staff because I also wear another hat as an accounting educator. And I've done some very large initiatives with Xero, and I really do love them as a company. I just made a choice to be an early adopter uh, on the accountant side, helping clients who use FreshBooks. But it was not because there's anything at all wrong with Xero. Most small businesses who select Xero really do end up loving the software and the company. And I will also say that most accountants who choose to build a business by serving clients on Xero really, really love it. Uh, it's a company that really creates an affinity from its customers and its accountant users. Um, now, this would be a very good way to describe FreshBooks as well. Um, but I wouldn't say that the, you could use that description for the larger accounting software companies. Um, they're not going to have as many rabid loyal f and loyal fans as Xero and FreshBooks do. Uh, Xero does have a strong network of officially certified accounting professionals called Xero Advisors. Um, in the US, um, the, all Xero users can access that. I think it's important to point this out because you're going to eventually need professional help from an accountant or bookkeeper. You can search the Xero accounting directory and interview several people. If you haven't picked an accounting software, one strategy would be to look up a couple of Xero accountant advisors and interview them and look up a couple of FreshBooks accounting partners and interview them. I'm one of those FreshBooks accounting partners listed in the FreshBooks directory, by the way. I'll put the links to the FreshBooks accounting directory and the Xero accountant directory below so you can easily schedule a few appointments with Xero and FreshBooks accounting partners. All right, so let's summarize. Uh, check out my comparison videos of Wave and QuickBooks Interview a couple of Xero Advisors and FreshBooks accounting partners to help you get the information you need to make your decision about those two softwares, if that's what you're considering. Your bookkeeping software is going to be the foundation of your business, and it is not a decision to take lightly. FreshBooks and Xero are both great products and, make, and great companies. It's just a matter of what features you need in bookkeeping software. So this video is pretty short. <laughs> no matter what software you choose, I wish you all the best as you build your business. Uh, make sure you surround yourself with the expert support that you're going to need. I promise that you don't want to try to do business all by yourself. Uh, your business is not going to make it if you do. And if you're interested in ongoing support, don't hesitate to reach out to me. I'm happy to have a quick call with you to see uh, what, what your issues are and if I'd be able to help. And that also lets you know if you're a good candidate for a program I run called the Fresh Bookkeeping Network. Um, I host weekly office hours in that group 
and answer questions for people who are doing their own bookkeeping on FreshBooks but still want access to a FreshBooks Pro. If you appreciate this content and would uh, like to say thanks, best thing you can do is that trifecta of YouTube support. Hit the subscribe button, hit the thumbs up, and leave a comment or question below, and that really helps me as I build this YouTube channel. I'm Kate Josephine Johnson, owner of Heritage Business Services, and I help business owners build their business legacy.